Hi again, this is Robert with Clean Pool and Spa, and in this video I'm going to discuss cyanuric acid again. Uh, and this is mainly for newly filled pools uh, and getting that cyanuric acid in there very quickly. Cyanuric acid, stabilizer, conditioner, it's all the same thing. All right, but how do you get that chlorine and stabilizer in there quickly? Uh, let's say you have a new in-ground pool and you just filled it up, or you have an above-ground pool, you just filled it up, or you uh, have maybe there was some kind of staining, uh, you did an acid wash, you drained it, you refilled it, and you need to get chlorine in there quickly, and you need to get cyanuric acid in there quickly. Well, you want to use a special kind of chlorine. It's called dichlor. Dichlor, dichlor chlorine is a stabilized form of chlorine, unlike the other two kinds of chlorine, which is calcium hypochlorite, the granular chlorine, and the sodium hypochlorite, which is liquid chlorine. You want to use dichlor chlorine, and this is pretty much the only time that you want to use dichlor. This is not for weekly pool maintenance and or weekly shocking of your pool. Okay, uh, this is a special kind of treatment when you want to increase your your chlorine and your especially your cyanuric acid. All right, so again, to increase your cyanuric acid, you use dichlor. Well, how much do you use? This right here. If you want to increase your, your cyanuric acid by 10 parts per million, you, per 10,000 gallons, you will use one and a third pounds of dichlor. Now, uh, if you want to increase your cyanuric acid 20 parts per million, well, you've just increased this part, so you increase the amount. If you want to increase it 30 parts per million, you've increased it three times, just increase this three times. <coughs> Now, now, for example, if you want to increase your cyanuric acid 10 parts per million for 20,000 gallons, well, you've doubled the gallons, so you simply double the amount. Uh, you increase it 10 parts per million for 30,000 gallons. Well, you've just tripled the uh, water, so you have to triple the amount. Okay, and I hope that makes sense. This is your baseline right here. If you can do basic second, third grade math, this is a piece of cake. All right, it's very, very simple. Now, my suggestion is to not go overboard with the dichlor because it can get out of hand very quickly. And you want to do this in stages. Uh, the, the cyanuric acid ranges 30 to 50 parts per million. So that means that you may need to shock the pool two, even three, maybe even four times, okay, until you get to the 30 parts per million mark. And that's where, that's the starting point. You don't want to shoot for 50 because then you're going to end up on the top end. You're going to use trichlor tabs, which have the cyanuric acid in them, which slowly dose your pool uh, throughout the week with cyanuric acid, and it's going to start creeping up. So you want to start low, hit that 30 mark, Stop with dichlor and start with the normal unstabilized chlorine, okay, either the liquid or the granular. All right, I hope I'm making this clear. Again, you want to shoot for that 30 mark, the 30 cyanuric acid mark, stop with the dichlor and start with a regular chlorine, okay? And that way, this is a perfect way to get chlorine and cyanuric acid into your newly filled pool very, very quickly. So, like, subscribe, comment. Go ahead and check out uh, the description box below. It has links to my website. Lots of great information over there. So, I'm Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. Hope this helped. And as always, be safe and happy swimming. Bye.